Hello, hi, assalamu alaikum viewers. My name is Sadia Farhan and we are discussing history of mass media. We have discussed history of America in our previous lecture and today we are continuing it. In this lecture we will discuss about the early 20th century and then jazz journalism in early 20th century, then the impact of Great Depression over press, then post-war newspapers and then contemporary developments. So let's have a look. The early 20th century, the number of daily newspapers decreased in this era because expensive linotype machines were the main reason of decrease of daily newspapers. And then there was another factor that advertisers only preferred papers which have largest circulation. Then newspaper chains grew quickly in this era. Then by th 1933, six chains owned, six chains controlled almost 81 dailies. Jazz journalism, it was a short but lively period of time. At the end of World War I, United States enjoyed a decade of prosperity. The papers that best exemplify jazz journalism sprang up into New York. They were tabloids. They were printed on a page half the size of original newspapers, richly illustrated with photographs and easy for people to handle on bus stands or subways. These, the example of jazz journalism is New York Daily News. The impact of Great Depression. Income of newspapers dropped and there were multiple reasons behind this as population increased. Then worsening economic conditions also caused the decline of newspapers. Then the emergence of radio as competitor of advertising revenue. These were reasons that had a great impact on press. Post-war newspapers. In this time, in this period of time, you will see a lot of terms. Concentration, chains ownership, conglomerates. In 1945, 60 chains controlled about 42% of daily newspapers. Then, several media conglomerates controlled newspapers, magazines, radio and television. Then, trend of concentration also came forth in this time. Another continuing trend was competition among media for advertising dollars. Then, rising television industry cut significantly the print media advertising revenue. Contemporary developments. Investigative reporting gained much attention in 1970s because of the efforts of Washington Post reporters, Bob Woodward, Carl Bernstein, they exposed Watergate scandal. Birth of USA Today came forward in 1980s. In this paper, there were graphics, colors. It was easy to read. There were graphs, tables, charts, and factoids. Factoids means a list of boiled down facts. Public journalism, the concept of public journalism also came forward in contemporary developments. It was more than just news. Reporters should try to help communities to solve their problems and encourage participation in political process. 